Hey everybody, so um, I'm going to try to do a Pinterest cleaning hack, I guess. Um, so this stain that you see right here on the mattress is put in from my kids and it was from probably about six months ago, so you can tell it's very hard like really plasticky. I've never done this before, this cleaning tack, so you're going to find out with me if it works or not. So on the thing it said all you need is a water bottle. I got mine from Walmart for 88 cents. Um, I'm using this as a measuring cup because you need uh, three tablespoons of baking soda. I already had it. It was for the pool. Um, and you need a towel to dry it up afterwards. You need a sponge with a scrub pad uh, to scrub it in. You need some hand, um, some washing liquid. So I got the Dawn Total Clean Pomegranate Awakening Scent. Um, and you need the hydrogen peroxide. So you, I guess, will start off with the, it said you needed like eight ounces of the peroxide. So it has little measurements here. I think this one is the eight ounce one because all it says is the number eight. So I'll just guess that. I'm sure I have enough. Maybe I should just open it. Hmm. So much that is. Nowhere near. Hope I have enough. Sure is a lot. Okay, that's it. Alright, and it said you need a drop of detergent. So, hopefully that is just a good drop. I usually get carried away with stuff, so I tried not to just then. Baking soda. I'll just kind of measure it out with this. Mm, that's about it. And it says use it right afterwards. So once you mix this, you're supposed to use it right afterwards. Well, it'd help if I cut it on, huh? Should have just bought some mattress cleaner. Haha, <laughs> I got it. I think the sprayer's probably a piece of crap. It's not spraying it at all. Maybe it's because of the bubbles. Or maybe it's because I don't have enough in it. You know what? About that. I'm just going to put it on the sponge. On the scrubby side. Whoopsie! Woo! <laughs> Woo! It's working pretty good if you can see through my hair. Now. 
pretty good, I think. Alright. Maybe that's why there's so much of it. Because you need it. Ugh, I wish I would have put my hair up. <laughs> put my hair up right quick all right so I'm sorry I didn't show it but I scrubbed a little bit more only for like one or two minutes and look it's clean I didn't think this hack would work but it does so yay <laughs> so all I did was um well this video is only seven minutes long so far so this is a really quick, easy way to clean a mattress, especially because I forgot if I told you or not. That was <laughs> those, that put in was on there for like six months to a year already, and it just came right out. So that's great. So I'll just put the towel on there, kind of soak it up as much as possible, kind of let it dry, and just flip it over. But next time I have to flip over the mattress, it should be clean. So. Yeah, I'm really happy. The hat, the, um, I guess you call it a hat or a tip or trait, whatever. The Pinterest hack door. So, this is how you clean your mattress. Thumbs up. <laughs> Bye. Oh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.